What is up everyone, it's DJ Garcia, Ray, Raymond Garcia. You guys probably already know because uh, I'm a few days late making this video. But on Monday, and I literally told you guys two days before that they could do this. And they did it, they did it. On Monday, Metallica announced tour dates for US. So now it's Saturday and yeah, I'm a few days late, but man, I'm, I'm very excited. I literally keep saying things could change. In my past videos, uh, in my channel updates, I keep saying things could change. And that's exactly what keeps happening. Things keep changing. And now, from wh what was, I could go to Metallica, now is basically something that you will see on my channel later this year in the summer. I am going to Metallica. They are coming here June 16th, a couple weeks after graduation. They will be here at the Cowboy State, uh, no, 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 the AT&T Stadium, my bad, pretty stupid. And I'm just very excited because it's just, again, I've never been to them, and if you guys follow my channel, you're an actual subscriber, you guys know how much I love them. And I was just so excited that day because they're going to be with Avenged Sevenfold, and Avenged Sevenfold was actually my first concert ever, you know, back in 2013. I went and seen them, uh, and they had fire at their show. I mean, it, it was so lit. And I really liked the stage, and I really like Hail to the King. I, I like Avenged Sevenfold. So the fact that they're together with Metallica, it's like, that's going to be amazing. And so I'm basically here to talk about what I would love to happen. What songs I would love to hear them play at the concert. That's what I'm here to talk about mostly. And basically to let you guys know that I will be going. I mean, me and my dad, I mean, my dad is the reason I'm, you know, into Metallica. You know, without him, I wouldn't be uh, a big fan like I am today. And everything works out perfectly because I told you guys, I'm going to Michigan in the summer and I have a party. I have a graduation party. So graduation is like the very beginning of June, like June 2nd, 3rd, one of those days. The concert comes here at June 16th, so it's a couple weeks after graduation, so that works out perfectly. And the party, the party in Michigan is the week after the concert, so it's like everything is so good and it's just, uh, timing is perfect. So, some of the songs I will talk about, I would love for them to play, but I know they're not. You can only play so many songs at a concert and they're just gonna... You know, they're gonna pick the best of the best. They're gonna play some of the new album and, you know, obviously all the classics, but, you know, they can't play every song, you know, so. Some of the songs I would love to hear, but I know they're not gonna play, would be Suicide and Redemption. Really like Death Magnetic. I really, really do, and that's one of the, you know, it's a really heavy instrumental, and then the, the, the middle part is so great. And then A Day That Never Comes. A Day That Never Comes is also a good one I love from that album. Damage Incorporated would be another song, but I just know they're not, uh, you know, I've been listening to Master of Puppets, uh, of quite recently, I've been listening to Master of Puppets, the entire album, and Damage Incorporated has been a good song that I've been listening to. It's one of their faster songs, uh, and I would like to hear that too. From the new album, I would obviously love to hear Spit Out the Bone. They have not played it live yet, but maybe maybe they will. I mean, they just they haven't played it live yet, and it's their best song from the album. It's probably it's the most hardcore from the new album. You just get, you have to admit it, please. And who knows? Maybe they haven't played it yet because they're saving it for U.S. I don't know. Maybe they're saving it for a special show. Am I Savage would be another song. And a lot of people don't like Am I Savage, but man, it's one of my favorites from the new album. I love Am I Savage. It's just a very powerful song, uh, and it's just so good. Another one I'd love to hear would be Justice for All. I would, uh, you know, the actual song. Uh, and it's just, it's a good song. I like it. Uh, when I watched the movie in 2013, uh, that's what got me into it. And uh, at first I didn't like it, but then, I, you know, it started to grow on me, and now it's one of my favorites. My last song that I would love to hear, but I don't, actually, they do play this song every once in a while. You know, it could happen, it could not. There's like a 50-50 chance. Orion. Orion is probably my favorite instrumental from Metallica. You know, they have like four. Uh, Orion, to me, was... Um, so cool and I, I discovered that song through the, uh, through the never as well and that's just my favorite instrumental I love it so much so now I'm gonna talk about the actual set list what I think Metallica will play when they come here so first off I think they will open up with Hardwired they've been doing that at every show now since the album came out I think they will start to show uh, with Hardwired and then after that I want them to play Creepin' Death because that's usually the opener that they had before Hardwired came out and I love Creepin' Death because it's such a good opener song you know they both are so I think Hardwired will play and I would hope Creepin' Death plays next because I really love Creepin' Death I basically just want to hear that song so I can chant you know like die die I think that would be a cool crowd moment after that I would love for them to play For Wom the Bell Toes because that's one of the first songs uh, I listened to as a kid like it's one of the first Metallica songs I started listening to next after that would be the Unforgiven This is a song that they play mostly at every concert they have they usually play 
Unforgiven. Uh, and so Unforgiven to me, the Black Album is probably like one of my favorites. The Black Album is like so close to being the exact same level. You know, it's right below Hardwired. But uh, if it's possible, they, they're both at the number one spot, okay? And so and so songs from the Black Album to me, uh, you know, Unforgiven would be great to hear. They probably will play it. Like I said, they play it at almost every show, so I probably will hear it. Then from the new album, I would love to hear Halo on Fire. Probably my favorite song on the first disc. The part I love most about the song, and I think a lot of people could agree with me on this, is the outro. The outro is just so cool and it's very powerful and it just, you know, the way that the, it changes and it's such a great outro and I would love to hear that double bass uh, from Lars, the drumming, you know, in that stadium, especially at and stadium, it would be cool to hear. After that, I would like to hear Now That We're Dead. I love the chugging on that song, it's so, it's just... Oh. Especially the solo. I really like the guitar solo, and so that's uh, that's another one from Hardware that I would like to hear. After that, we go back to the Black Album. I would like to hear Sad But True. Sad But True is another song, one of the earliest ones I started listening to. It's another one, so I would like to hear that. And then now we get into more of the classic, classic songs. These are the songs that they absolutely play the most. They play them at every single show uh, possible that they ever do. These are the songs that you you automatically know that they're gonna play, you know? So first off, we start with one. And it's very special to me because that, to me, is probably literally the first song I ever heard from Metallica. It, like, it's probably, like I keep saying, oh yeah, Sad But True and Foam the Bell Toes are some of the earliest, but one very well may be the actual, actual first song I heard from Metallica. So it'd be really cool. Uh, I mean, I already know they're gonna play it. It's gonna be really cool to hear it for the first time. And then after that, they're gonna play Master of Puppets. Again, this is just automatically, this is automatically, you you know they're gonna play it. Master of Puppets, probably their most famous song, uh, and so that's gonna be great to hear. And then Fade to Black. They usually uh, play Fade to Black as well, and I really like that one. It's very uh, emotional, and uh, not like emotional, but it's like the lyrics, if you just listen to the lyrics and you know the meaning behind the song, uh, it's very personal and deep. And so that would be great to hear, especially the outro for that song too, uh, it's really good. And then the closing songs would be Nothing Else Matters, I mean the Black Album again. And then the very last song uh, would be Enter Sandman, again the Black Album. And they usually play Enter Sandman toward the end or last. And so that is my playlist that I think they're gonna play, I mean things could change. But I'm just very excited guys, I mean it's my first concert, uh, no, you know, Metallica concert. And it's just that feeling, like, like we didn't get tickets yet, but just that feeling that they're gonna be here and that I have the opportunity to go. It's just, uh, uh, yeah, I mean, you should have seen me on Monday when I found out the announcement. I mean, this is just, if you guys don't know already, this is just my, this is like my life right here. This is like the main thing that I listen to. And some people make fun of me at school, or like my friends, but I don't care. These are my favorites of favorites like, of my all time. And so, so this video is basically just to let you guys know that I will, I mean, like it's not, I didn't get tickets again, but I just, just know that I probably will end up going with my dad. And it's just gonna, it's very exciting. You wanna know something else? I told you guys, I the concert happens here and then a week later, I'll be in Michigan for my party. They also go to Detroit, like Detroit is in Michigan. So what would be cool, if I go twice. Man, that would be so amazing. Can you imagine, I just go here first and then I go to Michigan and then they end up going to Detroit and oh, can I imagine if I go twice? That'd be amazing, that'd be cool. I, would, I wouldn't mind going twice. <laughs> but if you guys like this video, please give this video a like, it would really help me out. Comment down below, let me know if you're going to any of Metallica's concerts. And if you wanna see more on my channel, please subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.